Hello everyone, my name is Keith Glenna, and this is my 7 Days to Die Insane Mode series. Alright, so, uh, they didn't start me in a very good place. A lot of bird's nests, but it's gonna be very cold. So I'm gonna collect resources like I always do, but, uh... When it comes down to building my my base, I'm going to do something a little bit different this time and see how it goes. Because it just seems like a regular shack doesn't work. seems like uh, the cave isn't working very well. It's working a little bit better than the shack, but not by much. So I'm going to give something else a try and see how that goes. But, like I said, for now, I'm just going to run around and try and collect as much stuff before the zombies start populating. Alright guys, so this place will have to do. So what I am going to do is... So I'm going to be making a cross bridge and I'll sit up in the middle. And the theory is that while I am sitting in the middle, all the zombies will be running around in the middle and not attacking the posts where I will be safe. That is the hope. So I just got to upgrade all of these posts. Hopefully I have time to lay down some spikes and dig a little bit. I need a shovel. Yeah, I did. All right. I think that's why I like snow. Gotta make sure I don't fall in it while I'm up there, because that would suck. Like that. I gotta hurry up here. They should be starting to pop up pretty soon. Almost fell in. I think two layers should be good enough for now. Grab my spikes. Carefully go around. Good for now. I think I did everything I need to do down here. Sweet. Oh, yeah. Going to do that. Just in case I don't I can't pick up the bottom one. Which I can't, so Drop down, pick up, boom, before anybody noticed. So the other reason I picked this spot is because of the trees. I might be able to, I don't think I can reach that one. I should be able to reach this one. Nope. But either way, I can build a bridge across like one or two blocks over and collect wood while I'm up here which is 
amazing it is it is might be a lifesaver just having those couple trees but because um, it's going to take a lot of wood to to build this and seeing how I'm in the, the cold biome I'm going to need a lot of wood for fire so yeah well hopefully this works hopefully I don't make a gigantic fool of myself like I haven't already I guess with the other failed attempts I'm just hoping this one gets me past day three because that day three mark is just killer I hate it oh yeah, and the ramps I did for that Hope this is tall enough. I should be able to, yeah. Do something like this. Upgrade these guys. Still not a... There. So I will continue to add little things to this while I still can and come back either I'll come back when zombies start showing up or when it finally hits nighttime. Because those are probably only two things that will happen. Oh, there is a zombie right there. The lumberjack guy. Good thing about those guys is that they you have a good chance of getting... A, I don't know about good chance, but you have a chance of getting a fire axe. Which would be really nice to get. Because it can do way, way, way more damage than this stupid little stone axe can do for for taking out trees. Get way more wood much quicker. So hopefully, I'm actually hoping that he's tougher to kill, but I'm hoping he comes over here. Falls in the pit. Hopefully, I have time to run down and collect off of him. If not, it's not the end of the world, I guess. Well, in the game it is, but. But yeah, so I will come back if he. Uh, he decides to wander on over here, or if it hits nighttime first, whatever comes first. Surprise! He came over here, so so hopefully, yep, he falls into the pit. He is able to hop out, which kind of sucks, but oh, jeez, two of them. But it looks like they are not... Where are you going? Alright. So it looks like they're not attacking e the, any sides, so that's good. At least not yet. As long as I stay in the middle. And it looks like they're falling in if I do. Okay. Oh yeah, he's stuck. That one can hop out, but the other one... Oh, nope, they both can. Should have dug it one lower, but whatever. So as long as they're not doing damage to anything, I'm going to... Continue making stuff. So the only thing I can do up here is I have 36 arrows and the only that's the one downfall to being up here is you're too high up to actually hit them with any sort of uh, melee weapon. So I have to be able to kill them with arrows. So I need a very strong bow to do so. I like that. Now he's stuck. So I'm just going to boost up my my weapons and 
And yeah, and and get a stronger bow. Sorry, I got a little distracted. Um. So it looks like nothing's really going on with these guys. They're just running back and forth, running through my my spikes. Yes. So if something actually happens, if they start tearing down the walls or they're the posts, I'll come back. So I really have to do something about this. A third one showed up. Yes, it's crawling like the other ones, but I don't want three zombies roaming around in the middle of the night. So I I did up my, my weapons to be in the hundreds, so that should help get rid of these guys a little bit easier. They do wobble around a lot, which makes this thing way more difficult to shoot them. It really doesn't help either that they're freaking strong. It takes a lot to kill these guys. Just as much as those fat guys, I think. Can't tell if he's dead yet. Hmm. I think so. Alright, on to these two. Alright. Something's gotta happen. I'm not gonna get them all with these uh, arrows. I think they gotta go back in the pit. Come on, doofuses. Let's go back in the pit. Follow me. Alright. Back in there. Alright, now follow me this way. Stay in the pits. Oh, crap. Guess that guy wasn't dead. Back up to three. Hmm. Alright. See what I can do. Really hoping I can kill these guys before night. I really don't want to have to deal with three zombies running or er, crawling around middle of the night. And also I want to be able to uh re upgrade all the spikes back to their normal quality and potentially be able to get some nice goods from these guys because they potentially have pretty decent uh, stuff on them steady aim and horrible shot Jesus I suck at least I'm down to only two zombies I got the one just gotta take this one out 18 arrows. I don't know if I can take two of these guys out with 18 arrows. I don't know, but those spikes down there might do do my job for me with that other one. God, somehow they're still hitting the, the top pieces of wood even though they're crawling. I didn't know they could reach that high. But as long as they're not doing too much damage, this should be fine. I hate this little spinning thing that they do. It's hard to get a headshot on them. Let's see if I can get them back into the pit again. Come on, come on. There you go. Hey. Other one's getting out of the pit. Couple minutes left. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to get down there. These guys are too strong. That's that's the biggest downfall to being in the winter biome is that they are like impossible to kill. Where did I put my put the ramp over there? No. I'm going to attempt to run. I was going to see if I could get to that body over there, but... I think even crawling, they're still fairly quick. And it's just going to get darker, too. Just slap that there. Hopefully they don't take that down. That would suck. Alright, let's do a little patchwork here. And, yeah, see how many arrows I have left. 
14. Let's see if I can get rid of at least one of these with the 14 arrows. Stop twisting. It's God. If I can get any headshots on him. There we go, headshot. That was lucky. Come on. Seven more arrows. There's another headshot. Doing pretty good right here. There, nice. One more. And get it done with five. Not when I miss. Come on. That missed. There we go. That should have been a headshot. I don't think I'm going to get this guy in this last hit. Nope. Well, let's see if the pit will do its job. Come on. Back into the pit. Let's go. There you go. Get deep. Oh, nice. There we go. Got them all. Sweet. Only if this was a couple hours earlier. It's dark. And not fun. Let's see if I can collect a couple off of these close ones. Thought I heard something. Oh, oh, oh. I'm good. Alright. Let's do another check. Double check. Alright. I am very much paranoid right now. Nice. And nothing. Ugh. All that work, and not much. Can I fix them from here? Nope. Doesn't appear like I can. Hmm. So far, pretty quiet night. Alright, let's get rid of these guys. Come on. Come on. Oh, there you go. There. Nice. Half tempted to go down there and uh, fix those spikes still, even though it's nighttime. Actually, scratch that. I'm actually going to make clothes first, so I'm going to go and make some clothes and come back when I'm ready to hop down. Alright, here we go. And hop down, do a quick check around. Nothing, nothing. Nothing, and I think I'm good, undetected. Alright, three, two, one, go. Alright, go, go, go. Check this guy, and shit, nothing. One for three, Jesus. Alright. Quickly upgrade these. Fix these. We'll go, 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 go. Come on, and... Shit! Run, run, run. Oh. Got a little scared. I know nothing happened, but... Spend too much time down there, and... Too much noise. Anything can happen, anything could sneak up on you, and I do not feel like screaming tonight. So, yeah. Um, guess I got some of them back up, upgraded. Nothing showed up. Could go back down there. What the hell, let's do it. Alright, hop down. Quick look around. Nothing, and... 
All right, let's go. And go upgrade. Come on. Ooh. Get a little rush every time I go down there. Even though I know it's not real. Alright, so I think for the rest of the night I might just uh, wait it out. Um, I don't see it getting much more exciting for the rest of the night, so I think I might call it here. I might try and take out this tree and that tree, because I'm running really low on wood. But yeah, so do a little bit here and there, not much. Just wait it out and call it call it good for this episode. Um, all in all, I think this was a pretty good start. Could have started in a better biome, but beggars can't be choosers, you know. I'll make do with the winter biome. But anyways, if you like what you're seeing, please like the video. If you want to see more, please subscribe to my channel. Again, my name is Keith Klena. Thank you for watching and see you next time.